Here I am at 8344 South Everett Way, Unit B. This is actually the back side of the unit, but it is the garage entrance. And when you first pull into the neighborhood, uh, this is the first thing you see. Uh, the noise in the background is actually, sounds like some uh, tree service is uh, running a chipper. But I do believe this is the outside of the unit. So it's a corner unit and that's its little fenced area um, right there. So this is the street running behind. Neighbors across the way, foothills. And looks like there's extra parking in the community pool and clubhouse is right over here. Here's the entrance to Unit B. It's in the dark corner there, sorry. Uh, pretty bright out today. But just to give you an idea of the rest of the community back here, there's a couple spots where those Jeeps are parked and that's the only uh, free parking other than out on the, the street where I was before. <clears throat> and in here there's this little courtyard where it has the front doors of units A, B, and C. Alrighty, walking inside. We have, looks like, a, a real wood floor. It's still a type of laminate, but it doesn't look like it's a print. It looks like it could be cleaner. I can't tell if it's wear or just that's the type of finish. Um, so here we have a wood burning fireplace with a tile hearth on it. And here's that back area that I showed you before. And just to complete the view of this room, the stairway up and and the other rooms back there we'll go to in a moment. Let's do the kitchen. So we have a, a dining area here with a ceiling fan and light. Wooden uh, shades, which are kind of nice. So you have extra cabinets here, which is unusual. Granite counter, microwave, electric range, stainless sink. Yeah, these are not original cabinets. And just to give you some perspective, this is a loft up here. So we have a rather tall vault and looks like there's some shades up there as well. This does have central air. All right, down that hall, when we first uh, walked in the door. It uh, has slightly different, uh, this is what looks like a tile in the bathroom, a real newer uh, ceramic that looks like a wood plank. Uh, they've updated the, the cabinet and the countertop. The uh, tub tile needs a little work. Actually, it could be repaired and cleaned up pretty nicely. And then here's a bedroom with a vaulted ceiling. The lighting is via a lamp. So I opened the shade and uh, it's got nice windows. This one has a pleated insulated shade as well. So it makes it a little more energy efficient. And here's the laundry utility room. So the water heater is a slightly older unit, but not seeing lots of corrosion and whatnot. Carrier furnace looks a little newer. Has a laundry area. And here's the garage, which, well, they haven't quite moved out completely. So, but it's a one car garage, good insulated door, a little extra deep. So you've got some storage in here. All right, moving on. Oh, and by the way, 
The lights in the bathroom and the laundry are automatic. They just came on when I walked in. And they've closed the shade here and the view out the window on the landing is for the little courtyard in front. Carpet looks new. Another window on the side here overlooking the roof. And this is just an open loft area. Great for an office. I have seen some people uh, use this as an office space, but it's actually designed to be a, a bedroom. So here we have laundry. I mean laundry, sorry, bathroom. And they broke a rule. They've got carpet up against the tub, but that can be remedied. Here's the, there's a shower in here as well as a, a toilet. And same thing on the tile in here. It needs some touch up, but not terrible. Uh, they did some iron pipe conversion for the closet. It's not attached, so if you wanted to do something different, that's easily disassembled. And it looks like it's got a whole house fan. That's for venting hot air out. Skylight. And then overlooking down below. So this could be made more private if you want, or or it can work just fine. So I can see why they had the shades closed. I can look in the neighbor's window across the way. But otherwise, it's not too bad here.